Hi guys, Joel from Artistic Coffee Roasters. Today we're going to be talking about grinders. One of the most common questions I get asked is, should I buy a grinder? Or why should I buy a grinder? First of all, before we even get into the video, yes, you should buy a grinder. There's a couple of reasons for that. Coffee has a shelf life. After we've roasted it, uh, carbon dioxide is escaping out of the beans, but also a lot of flavors and aromas are slowly escaping out of the beans as well. Uh, like a banana, it's probably only at its premium for a short amount of time. We don't want to be using our coffee when it's really, really old. Like a banana, it gets a bit, uh, a bit rancid. You don't want to go there. Um, once we grind coffee up, that process of aging uh, and getting old happens at a far more accelerated rate. So our, most of our coffees are at a really nice premium level of flavor for around three weeks. Once you grind it, you're probably reducing that three weeks to around three days or something along those lines. Now we understand that not everyone can afford a commercial grinder like this EK43 here, um, but there's lots of different levels that you can go. Uh, if you're making your coffee in a plunger, in an AeroPress, in a V60 or other mobile devices, to be honest with you, the hand grinders that we stock and sell, the Rhino hand grinders, are a really great option to be using nice fresh ground coffee to get the most out of your coffee. Once you move up to our domestic level machinery, that's more aimed at when you have an espresso machine. Another reason that we actually recommend having a grinder with an espresso machine is so you can actually adjust your grind in different conditions, whether that be humidity or temperature. Uh, and as the coffee ages, we're making changes to our grind to get an optimum extraction and obviously the optimum flavor out of it. If you're getting your coffee pre-ground and you're not able to adjust your particle size, you're not getting the most out of your coffee machine uh, or the coffee that we're roasting for you. Um, so really in summary, yes, you should buy a grinder. Uh, it's more about what level grinder is going to be suitable for you. We'd all love to have a really expensive grinder sitting on our benches at home for those small amount of use that it gets. But realistically, even a small hand grinder can be a really good option to start off with. And as I said, if you have an espresso machine, we really recommend that you have at least a domestic grinder that has the grind adjustment that you can, you can make to get the most out of all the artistic coffee uh, that's roasted for you. If you've got any other questions, please put them in the comments below. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to our channel, hit us up on our website.